What's up, everybody? Welcome to this episode of Single Player with Nathan Webb. But wait! Before we start the intro, a little riff with me running through people. By the way, that's me, not Luigi. I just want to tell you guys that I appreciate all the love and support I've gotten so far here on Single Player. And I want to encourage you to keep on sharing that love because I am looking to give you guys something really special whenever I reach 50 subscribers. So I'm currently squatting at 41, and if I can get nine more subscribers, uh, I really want to put out something special for you guys. I don't know what it will be yet, I just want it to be something cool and awesome for you guys. So um, please, click that subscribe button if you haven't, if you're just a viewer, or uh, share it with some friends, try and get some people talking about it. Um, yeah, we started Couch Collab, which has been really awesome with Hogan, so um, hopefully looking to get some more guests on there, so if you, uh, if you're in the North Carolina area and you're looking to collaborate, I'm totally down. Just let me know. Uh, so that being said, well, that's a better one either way. That's right. It's time for another episode of Single Player, only this time we're playing one of my personal favorite low-budget, low-credit GBA games. I think it was, was it? It was. It was Game Boy Advance. And it is just, wow, it has not aged well as I'm looking at it and just how pixely this is, especially on full-screen mode. So that might not be a great idea. I might undo that if it stays this low quality. Um, but Dragon Ball Z, The Legacy of Goku 1. Man, I'm telling you, I can remember so many car rides with this game going just in the background. All right, we're going to start a new game. Um, so Dragon Ball Z is one of my favorite series ever made, as well as it should be, because it's I feel it's amazing. If you don't know the story of Dragon Ball Z, that's a shame. You should stop watching right now and go watch the show. Um, so anyway, the way that this show works or the way that this game works, rather, is you play Goku. In the later games, you can actually play different characters, but in this game, you play Goku. And here we have all the different characters that are involved in the story. So, Turtle from Dragon Ball. Um, and you can get different things from everybody. There's Master Roshi. Master Roshi asks you a favor. He wants you to find his collection. Uh, Krillin, just talking, chilling. There's Gohan before he's abducted. Oops, spoilers, he's about to get abducted. And there's Bulma. Uh, yeah, so anyway, you're having a visit on Master Roshi's Island, and uh, <laughs> you got to collect the adult magazines that Master Roshi owns because he's a perv. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to remember all the commands. Cool, so you can fly. Um... That's all I got. Yeah, I remember there was one inside. Yeah. <laughs> it's so gross. Better stay down here. I don't think I can... I don't think I can steal anything. Yeah. So anyway, we're on this island. I'm just trying to activate the stuff to go ahead and activate the next event. So for each... um. For each magazine that you return, you get stuff. Oh, and there he is. There you are, Kakarot. Oh, who's Kakarot? You are, of course. You're not from this planet. You are a Saiyan warrior like me, your brother. Raditz. What is my favorite? Yeah, a Saiyan? Your brother? I don't believe you. So anyway, we have this little conversation. He steals Gohan and to convince Goku to go uh, destroy planets with him. There's Piccolo. Oh, Piccolo. Piccolo's like, I don't like him either, so we need to go handle this situation. Yep, so I'm going to go handle the situation by riding the Nimbus. There I go. Off to save my fun. So, okay, so there's like baddies. Basically, the way this game works is you are sent to kind of achieve the first, I think, it's like the first five graphic novels in the manga series, or manga, or whatever. Um, and then the first, like, seven or eight episodes of Dragon Ball Z. No, that sounds like too many. It's like, I don't know. Um, there's Chi-Chi. Chi-Chi, do you give me anything? Uh, yeah, so Gohan's been abducted, so you got to find him. But first, you so these characters get really, really tough, and so you have to make sure that you train. That's why I'm killing all these squirrels. 
Eponymous, I'm not just a squirrel hating person, but you just have to kill things to level up. So the best way to do it is to try and kill <laughs> try and kill the things that are weak first. And then um later on you can kill the stronger things. Like these crabs, it won't take long for them to kill you, so you have to attack them from a distance. And eventually they die like that. Don't ever get into a brawl fight in this game because or at least not with the not with at the beginning, because you're just way too ah, no no no! You're way too weak. Come on now, little crab. Okay. Um, so you have Kai Blasts, or Key, and the longer you charge it up, the farther it goes, the stronger it is. God, they're so annoying. It's not like um, Budokai and Budokai Tenkaichi in the way that you like charge up. You have to wait, which is a... Yay, level 3! Which is very pestersome, but it's fine. The best one is this one right here, because he can't get across the water, so you just keep blasting him until he dies. But yeah. This game is basically all about leveling up. Eventually, we're going to meet these wild dogs. And I remember the first time I played this game, it took me like hours to try and get strong enough to the point where they just wouldn't just bite me to death instantly. I'm kind of worried I might confront them. Some herbs. That's another trick to this game is just find herbs, collect herbs, and uh, they heal you. So, And every single time you change into uh, the next screen, they respawn. So you can collect, like, infinitely. But that's only if it's necessary. But eventually it'll become necessary to have a lot of healing items, because Goku uh, takes a big beating. And unlike in the anime, he doesn't so much just uh, always survive. He certainly dies. I've died many times in this game. Oh, and you can fly. I forgot to mention that. Um, not really much of a use for flying yet, though. And you get more flying points as you go on, because you can't just fly forever. Yeah! Uh oh. Sweet. Getting better at killing them already. I remember there were a lot of tricks and secrets to this game, so I'm going to try and find them for you guys so we can have like a real playthrough of this game. More than just a, like, this is more than just a uh, my average let's play, because normally I don't know how to play these games. This game, I know. I know this game know it very well. So this game has two in its series. Um, I just saw a Senzu bean, so I'm going to go grab that. There's the dog. All right, we'll see if I can kill this dog. It's doubtable. Oh, come here, you dumb dog. Um, so there were two games, or no, yeah, there were two, oh dear, he saw me. This is very bad. This is very this is this is tremendously bad. I don't know if I'll make it. Oh no. Oh man. Okay. That was not enough. Go in the house. No! <laughs> Are you kidding me? All right, I'm just gonna try and just blast him away. That's not enough. I gotta use a sensu bean already. Come on, you dumb dog! Ah, dang it! Just when I was trying to tell you guys how good I was at this game, then he becomes an angel. All right, well I'm gonna get back to that point and then I'm gonna turn the camera back on. So I'll see you soon. <laughs>
Um, what was I saying? Yeah, so Legacy of Goku and Legacy of Goku 2. And this one tells the story of um, all the way up to Frieza. And Legacy of Goku 2 tells the story up through Cell. And then the third game, which isn't a Legacy of Goku, it's called Boo's Fury. And it obviously tells the story of Boo with some additional side quests that are a lot of fun, like Janemba and things like that. So, yeah. Fun games. Fun times. Where am I going? I feel like I'm about to run into a dog. I don't feel like I need to go here. This seems dangerous. <laughs> I just I just know. I just know there's going to be a dog, and then I'm going to die again, and then I'm going to have to start over again, and that's no fun. I don't like starting over. Anyway, I guess I'll keep on grinding. Um, and then I'll come back at you guys next time whenever I'm ready to take on some dogs. Some big baddies. I wouldn't really call them big baddies. Either way, I'll see you next time here on Single Player with the Legacy of Goku. <laughs>